Hey folks, it's Rithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. We've had a nice little break. I think we're safe from the dinosaurs for a minute, so let's go back and have another go with them. As soon as that is ready, we can use it and we can equip the saddle on Windwalker right here. And we'll be able to ride her all the way back. Uh, yeah, female. Primitive. Right, close. Equip saddle. Oh, where's my saddle? There. Saddle. There. Ha ha ha! Easy ride. Look at this! We are riding our first dinosaur. Oh, that is beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful. Look at it. Isn't it wonderful? The graphics are a bit low on this, but it's still fine. Okay, let's go. What? What, why, why, why aren't you moving? Okay, I don't know what I just did there. I pressed the two mouse buttons together. Why aren't you moving forward? Oh, wait. <laughs> I reckon, look. Oh, no. Um, right, right. Do I go inventory here? And do I see my dinosaur? Engram points, tame groups... No, that's... That's my inventory. So how do I see the inventory from the dinosaur? I don't think I can. There. Access inventory. Can I not access the inventory when I'm on the back of the dinosaur? There. Parasaur stylish saddle. Oh, I see. Right, I can... Uh, transfer. Use. Why can't I use that? Equip a parasaur with this to ride. Use this on... Oh, use it on... Oh, I see. Use it on the saddle. Right, so do I... Oh, I put that... Ah, there. Now we're talking. Right, now let's... let's uh, now we've got the stylish saddle. That's even better. That is cool. <laughs> oh, this is fantastic. Right, well, we, we're not going to be able to move because of, like, we're stuck. But how do I get to my dinosaur's inventory? Drop all, sort, new folder, folder view, toggle tooltips. Where's my dinosaurs at? Me? I don't want to be looking at me. I want to look at my dinosaur. Tame groups. Explorer's notes. What's this? Frithgar demolished. That's no good. Uh, target inventory. F. There we go. Right. So now if we have a look. See. 600 out of 500. Because of the weight. My weight. And her weight combined. Means that it's too much. She can't cope with both of them together. So what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to drop a little bit of this. So if I dump that down, that's gone down uh, with 560 out of 537. She's slowly leveling up, but it's not going to be fast enough. We'll drop that a minute. Uh, 552. That's 40 points. Oh, I've only got there. Yeah, that's 13 points. 539 out of 537. 537.7. Alright, let's drop that. Right, I'm just underweight. No, I'm still not moving. I'm not moving at all. Fine. Let me go F like that. And, right, 536.2 five, five, out of 53. I should be able to move. What was that? Oh. It's just that one landing. It's it's very loud, that thing. Really sure what to make of that. It's like it's, it's very nerve-wracking experience having that land and scream next to you. Right, uh Well, it's there, level up. The dinosaur is leveled up. Literally just time going by because they're quite a low level, they're doing it quite quickly. So if I increase the carry weight there, Windwalker level twelve was leveled up, so five three six out of five five six. Uh, 
I'm using the dinosaur because they can run faster. This is not quite what I was hoping for. I see it right up in the top right corner up there. If I press H, it shows. Can't run and can't jump. Stamina, health, uh, 536 out of 556. I'm not sure what the weight is. All right, well, we'll just have to dump 100 timber. So let's, um, let's drop that a minute. There. Right, now that's... Ah, that's better. They're not actually that fast, but this is running right here. This is full running speed now. So what I could do, in theory, is I could I could catch another one, and then we could go out and we could we could have like a train of parasaurs. If I go and capture that one, yeah, let's do that. You stay right. You're following me anyway. So let me switch over to this one here, and do that. Hey! Did you really just do that? Seriously, did you really just do that? I cannot believe you just did that. Right, uh, behavior. Enable only target conscious. Yeah. Yeah, 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 we'll, we'll definitely use that as a... That... There's a massive amount of poop right there. <laughs> oh, yes, this is brilliant. That is a serious quantity of poop. Although that thing over there, that'll produce even more. Right, so let's go back to you. Behavior, so only target conscious. And... Stance, attack your... No, don't attack my target. We see, yeah, uh, passive. Neutral. I'm going to leave that as neutral. So now we have a look. Behavior. Only target conscious stance neutral. Disable ally looking, enable wandering. I think this is what we want. So I go to stance. You've got passive, you've got neutral. I don't know what the different ones do, but I'm assuming neutral is the one that we want. Uh, change targeting range, change follow distance. Ignore, disable ally. Right, now we go back again, and then we've got behavior harvest settings. Disable victim item collection. Disable resource harvesting. No. Right. Unfortunately, this one here didn't make it. There's nothing in this one's inventory. Let's take the hatchet and we will harvest this one for hides. We get some meat, but mostly hides if we use the hatchet. Here we go, 75 hides. You are a jolly nuisance. You know that? You are a jolly, jolly nuisance. I want another parasaur now. Oh, never mind. Right, let's go. This, this, this bad boy right here. Uh, yeah. So I press shift and run. I think I can actually run faster than this one on his own. So there's that great big dinosaur right there. We'll leave that one for now, but maybe we will come along and we will use that one at a later date. Which would be pretty cool, because I think that one, if you use it, you can, like, sweep the tail around and it harvests everything that might be nearby. But I don't know if it gathers timber or not bit of a slow process having him wander up the hill like this but he does get there eventually we've got our fire going uh do i have any meat oh i do the, the meat is on this one right i think what i need to do hang on i want to go like that there and we'll climb off like that oh i meant to pick that stuff up Right. Um, yeah, I'm thinking with the parasaur, what we'll do is... Actually, I'm not sure what we'll do. It's going to try and follow me now into the house. I don't really want it to follow me into the house. We've got a load of meat here that's all cooked and ready. So I want to transfer that back to me and also that. And then 
Transfer that into the fire. Along with those. We could do with building a cooking fire because then you can put more meat cooking at once. Although we've got a load of meat now, which is going to keep us going for a while. A little bit of that. And... Yeah, that's fine. Uh, I want to go back to you, and I just want to sit on this one's back for a minute. And then uh, you press F to go in here, don't you, so that we can access this. So I want to take all of that timber onto me, like this. Can I not take any more? It's not letting me take any more. That one's now leveled up. Carry weight. I'm actually thinking that movement speed would be better because 106. It seems really slow. It does. Oh, okay. Movement speed boast, uh, bo boast, boost. It doesn't actually increase by very much. And now this one down here, in order to be able to make, I need thatch. I need lots and lots of thatch. So I'll go back to inventory and. Oh, you have got a, you've got a maximum weight limit that you can carry. Like it's here, I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying to press T so that I can carry some more stuff across. It's not physically letting me. Like if I go there. It's exactly double what my carry weight limit is. Ah. Right, okay. Well, I didn't know that. Okay, so then I can take all of those. That gives me a, a great big pile of thatch. I've now got those bits of wooden wall there. But I had... What was this? This was a large wooden wall. It's as tall... Four? As tall as four normal pieces of wall. Uh... I'm not going to build that. I don't really need a tower at the moment. Um, we've got some windows. I just want some walls, really. I just want some, some wall sections to, to finish building our wall. So we want that one there. Uh, do I want 14 of them? Yeah, why not? Go for it. Make 14 of them. So we get 14 of these, and then we can start wandering around and putting those all in place. So that's lowering the weight that I'm carrying. Yes. By a significant amount. I've got a level up now. Which we're going to go with... I think I'm going to put the food and water up to 150. Get that all the way up to 150. And then we've got a stone dinosaur gateway down there. Megaloceros saddle. Sloped stone walls. Yeah, we'll keep working. We'll, we'll work through these. A reinforced wooden door. Stone stairs. Stone triangle. That's enough for a minute. Oh, stone fence foundation. Yeah, I'll, I'll build all of the stone stuff. 14 pieces of wall. I've got some more timber. Let's, let's take the rest of this timber. Can I? Oh, I don't think I... Can I? I should be able to. Yeah. Yes, I can. Right, you're encumbered. So we got that. I want to take those. Uh, we've got the silica. We've got all of the chitin as well. So then I go back to crafting and I want to make... You know, I may as well just make some more walls for a minute. I can only make three more of them anyway. What am I running out of? Oh, I've run out of wood. Right. Can I carry all of this? Wait, 164. Yes. Now you... Like that. Behavior. Disable following. Right. So that one should just stay there. Just being a good... Oh, I know what I needed to make. I wanted to make some door frames. That was something I wanted to make. Have a look in there. I. Oh, no. It was a, a wooden... Oh, wait. But I do have that one. I can take you. I've got the... Yeah, I've got the thatch and stuff. And more here. You, you, and you, like that. So we'll make two door frames, and we'll make two doors, and I'll make some more stuff with windows as well. Uh, door frame, there. So I'll make two of those. One, two. What's that? Wooden door. Oh, fibre. I need fibre now. Right, well, I've, I've definitely got, I've got the fibre there, and in you, I don't have the fibre. Okay, fine. And we go back to here, and then I'll put the water up to 150 like that. I'll go back into crafting and doors. Wooden door. 
So where's the reinforced? We had that new door there. The, the re oh, there, down there. Uh, oh, you seriously? I need stone for a reinforced wooden door. That makes lots of sense. Right, one and two of those to go with our two wooden door frames. Then we want some more of those. I reckon two of them. One, two. Yeah, that'll do for a minute. What are we on? Oh, I'm I'm way overweight still. Well, I got I got an easy way around that actually. I got I got a very easy way around that. We'll take those wooden walls right there, and I'll press number eight like that, and I'll put that one up there, and then I'll press number eight, and I'll put that one up there, and I'll put that one up there. So that's already freed up. Oh. That's freed up practically nothing. I've got... My carry weight is really quite substantial. <laughs> uh, Alright, well, <laughs> I'll have to drop a load of stuff in here so that I can move. No! Oh, I just pressed E instead of T. Transfer the raw meat and transfer the chitin as well. Well, right, and the silica pearls and the oil. And also the bits of armor. Although they, they don't... Oh, I'm, I'm out of space now. I can't move anything else. Um, let's go to that one then. And we'll move... Eight, eight, eight. What about the walls? Wait 56. Wait 50. Transfer you, and you, and you. Can I move? Right, I can move. I don't appear to be ill. I thought there was a penalty for eating raw meat. Maybe there isn't. Or maybe I've not got that active at the moment, or something. I, d I don't know. Right. Oh, there. That one up there. You want it there, and you want it there, up there, like that. And then I will go... The two wooden door frames, I'll put you into there, and I'm also... Actually, we'll just leave that for a minute. We'll swap them over in a second. So I want to go to number nine there. Put that one in there like that. And I want to go to number nine in there and put that one in there like that. Then we want to go into our inventory again, and we will drop that one in there. Number nine. Put you on there like that, and... Close that gate a minute, at the door rather, and there. That's better. Much better. And then these two here, we can put windows on these. We didn't have windows on them previously, but we're going to do that now. There. So I go to you and number nine. Nope. There. Number nine on that one. And then I want opening and closing windows. Obviously, we we can't do this without opening and closing windows. So we want to be able to get those as well. That one is that window right there. I can make one. Let's go over here and open you so we can take that, that, and that. And now, too full to move once again. So I will take... Right, I want to make one more of those. That Those windows right there, which is... Trapdoor. Wooden window, right. So now I want to be able to make another another level. Wooden trapdoor, no. Uh, wooden wooden ceiling, right there. One, two, three. Oh, I can make three wooden ceilings right now. So we go over to here and we will put in our new windows. Right there. So I wait. Why have I? Oh no, the ceilings. That's why. There, see? Ceilings. Uh, they automatically go the same way. They appear to automatically go the same way. This is good. We're going to want a staircase going up there. And if we go back in and we have a look there, I've got these two windows that I want to pop into here as well. So put that one onto there, and I'll put that one onto there. So then we can open it, and we can open that one as well means that we can peer out into the world. It's getting darker in here. We're going to want better sources of light. Now, we can do this. We've got the... Well, we have the means now. We can go into here. So, we've got there. I want, so, cooking pot must contain basic fuel to put various ingredients with water in this to make soups, stews, and dyes. 
I thought that you could cook basic items in here as well. Engram points. So what about cooking? I mean, you got the that one right there. That requires a campfire as the basic. And then... Right, so we've got the wooden cage. We've got the compost bin. I'm going to build a whole water irrigation system and bring that all the way up from the water down the bottom. That's on our to-do list. Hyena Dom. No, there was a hyena. Right, wall torch can be crafted at the smithy. Requires a... St I've already got the standing torch. The wall torch would be a good one to have, though. And we've already got... I have learned the smithy. That's one that we've got. So then I want to go... Wait, what am I looking at next? Pike, there's the stone fighting items, those are. Uh, sorry, uh, metal fighting items. Um, now, what am I looking for? Swords, megalosaurus, so catapult turrets, toilets, lance, diplodocus saddles. This is so cool. Terror birds. There is some big stuff here. Stone staircase there. So what is it that I was actually looking for? I was looking to see if there was like another cooker or something like that. Or if it's just the campfire. It, lo it looks like it's just the campfire and, and uh, the one that we got. The cooking pot. It doesn't appear that we get anything. So you get the cooking pot right there. And then we've also got the, not the cement paste, uh, large storage box. Yeah, we've got the refining forge. We've got the smithy. But I don't think the refining forge is what you'd want. I'd want, like, a cooker of some kind. A grill. Or maybe you've got to unlock metal for that. Let me look down further. Maybe it's... It's probably in one of those. Okay. We can live with that. So now let's go to this here. And we'll just make this a little bit brighter. And I want to look in there. So I've got nothing of use in that one. And I have a look in here. I've... I don't actually have anything of use in there either because what I was wanting to do is I want to go into crafting right there and I want to make this cooking pot. I need 75 stone and I need 10 wood. And I do not have either one available. I do have a level up. I do have another level up. Alright, well we'll go food on that one and I won't take any more points for a minute. Our fire is blindingly bright. Okay, we've, we're using three now on the gamma. I think three is not quite right, is it? Oh, they're still cooking. No, I haven't got. I haven't got any meat. Okay, let's let's go outside. We want to get a little bit of stone. So if I go with the pickaxe like that, stone. I'm getting a lot of flint out of this, and not very much stone. If I go with the hatchet, do I get? Right, hatchet on stone. I need to use hatchet on stone. Why can't I repair it? What do I need to repair it? I need one piece of timber. Okay. There, one piece of timber. Now I can repair it, and then I can go back over here and we can get some more stone. Your primitive stone hatchet is repaired, so there we go. We can busy hack through that. Little tiny bit more stone, and then I can go here. 23, 33, 40, 60, 70. Tyree is the, 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 the little guy. We're waiting for him. I wondered where he'd got to. He's been wandering around. He's been doing a lot of wandering. He's, he's gone, like, he's traveled many miles, he has. Uh, oh, I need 10 wood. He can barely move. Uh, just gave me 60. That that ought to be enough. 60, 60 pieces of timber ought to be enough. There we go. I want to make that one. That's going to give me my new cooking spot right there. Cook, cooking spot, cooking pot. We'll take out one inside and we'll set that one up. That one is weighing me down. Okay, my weight is not too much now. So we'll slowly, slowly make our way back into the house. We're going to want to be able to put a... We do want a staircase in the house. That's another important thing to get. And we're also going to want to... Well, I want to put this cooking fire down first. That's kind of the next thing I want to do is... But where am I going to put it? What's going on? 
Oh! Right, if I'm looking out from here, it's not raining. If I go and stand over here, it is actually raining, and then you can see it's raining everywhere. That's a very weird way of doing it, isn't it? That is a very strange thing to have happen, I think. The fire doesn't go out. All right, we're going to put our cooking pot down in that corner there. Let's go cooking pot, and we'll put you down there. I've still got some... No, no, I don't want to use the rest of the walls for a minute. Let me put those in here. Let me take you. Oops, I want to... There. Transfer those out. Transfer... The walls won't transfer in. Oh, I see. No, I don't have room in here. Right. Well, I'll transfer out a bit of meat there. There we go. Right, so there's 32. It's gone in there. And then we will take nine there. And cooking pot is obstructed. How much space does this take? Oh. Yeah, that's fine. We can put that one there. Access inventory. Demolish, pick up cooking pots, add note to make recipe, demolish there, and that's the one that I want. Okay, so if I take this and I drop in that, does it just cook it like normally? Storage 1 of 12. Drop in some timber as well, light fire. Does that work in the same way as the fire over here? I'll put you out a minute. I want to go back to daytime darkness levels like this. Actually, I can, no, 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 don't, don't, don't light. I want to access inventory. I want to go to there, and I want to take out all of that meat there. I've got loads of it now. I've got uh, what? Se Seventy-seven pieces of meat. I think that's going to be enough to keep me going. So I'm just going to consume a bit of a bit of food here until we've got our food level all the way back up again. As soon as I've done that, we can then check on the cooking pot and see if it's actually going to cook our meat. Uh, uh, you know, we've actually done it. So uh, now I can hold access inventory and you don't seem to be doing anything. Have I got to have a recipe for you? Am I not allowed to cook meat? Sates your hunger and provides health while being digested. Spoils in two minutes. Spoils in 13 minutes. Spoils in three minutes. You up there spoil in seven minutes. It's not doing anything. And unfortunately, folks, I'm going to have to interrupt things here. I think we could do with a little break. The dinosaurs... They can be a bit much sometimes. So if you've enjoyed the episode, then please head down below and give us a like. And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye and see you later.